Kotaro. Follow her. Find her. Only she can stop the creeping death. A child from beyond our forest. She is one of you. One of us. And yet unlike either. For she is one with the mountains and wields the sentinel's strength. The sparrow does not belong here. She must return to her home. Only there can she do what must be done. If she remains, if none can help her, the creeping death will consume us as it has consumed so much else. And all will return to dust. Mm. Indeed. Take this path to its highest point. There lies the sentinel. There hides the sparrow. Guide her, sparrowkin. She knows it not, but she needs you as much as you need her. Mm, very well. We are Vargil, stewards of the Sentinel, friend to the Sparrow. We are here. We are always. Together in mind, though rarely in body, we walk the frozen land. Once, we were many. But we do not spread like the Uriki. And we are hunted every few seasons. Uh, the Uriki are small, but their numbers are endless. <sighs> we feel every death as if it were our own. The Sentinel is the beginning, and a bastion against the end. It is our forest's heart and protector. Long ago, the Sentinel gave its heart to the Sparrow. We know not why. And so, the creeping death grows ever nearer. Twisted. Gnarled, an oak corrupted by time and indifference. Yes, root is a good word. Mm. Let me remember, let me recall. Ah, yes, only the sentinel knows, and perhaps not even that. She and her companion came to our forest against their will. The Uriki hunted them, as they do all who wander the forest. She found the Sentinel. He did not. And since that day, the Sentinel and Sparrow have been one. Uh, we do not know. The Uriki left nothing of him behind. This path will take you to the Sentinel. Seek the highest point. The Sparrow hides there. You are her kin. You will guide her to face the creeping death. Or the Sentinel will fall.